With Vancouver's real estate volumes down by 25% compared to recent year's highs, 2018 turned out to be an interesting year in real estate. Hi, my name is Sean Brown with West Haven Group and this is my December market update. Plus, some thoughts on interesting opportunities that lie ahead in 2019. Firstly, the market remains slumped, with the total number of sales transactions well below typical levels. During 2018, house prices went down by 8%. Townhouse prices are still up by 1.3% and condo prices still up by 0.6%. But prices have been inching down in recent months. Homeowners have still done very well on their investments over the past few years. However, they have seen a portion of their appreciation reverse due to changes to the mortgage qualification rules, increases to the foreign buyer's tax, and the introduction of the empty home tax. Thank you, Mallory. This last year was interesting. After three years of price appreciation and bidding wars, the market turned suddenly in March. Demand dropped and sales volume went down by 25%. It was interesting for me in particular. At the same time that I was helping my seller clients through these changing times, I had also listed one of my very own investment properties, and I became extremely frustrated when it turned out to be such a tough sell. This being said, there are several opportunities in the near future for a few different groups. Number one, first time home buyers. Prices have softened and conditions are favorable for buyers right now. Number two, upsizers. Condo and townhouse prices have risen over the past few years, but house prices haven't performed quite as well. The gap between them is much smaller than what we typically see, so now would be a good time to make that jump. And three, investors. Conditions are in your favor, take advantage of them. Thank you for watching. I hope you found this helpful. Please leave any questions or comments that you may have.